Melt any object in Blender. You need a relatively high poly mesh, so you may need a subsurf modifier. Don't forget to shade smooth. Open up a shape key and add one. Now let's add another one and title this one Melt. Tap into edit mode and select a few vertices where you want the melting effect to take place. Make sure that proportional editing is turned on. Now pull these vertices down on a Z axis as far as you want the melting to take place. Do this to as many vertices as you want. Tap out of edit mode and you can use this value slider to control that melting effect. You can animate this as well. So at frame one, let's add a keyframe. And then at 60, turn that value up to one. If we play back, we've animated it. Let's smooth this out with a subsurface modifier. Cool thing is we can stack this. If we add another shape key, we can use a different type of fall off. Let's choose random and pull this down again. And now we can stack these on top of each other, animate them simultaneously, and boom! To accentuate this effect even further, you can animate the material to make it look like it's heating up and melting. Click the link in my pinned comment to learn how to 